Lewis Fancher from Wikipedia, the free online encyclopedia at www.wikipedia.org. Lewis Delton Fancher, born December 25, 1884, died March 2, 1944, was an American artist and illustrator, notable for his drawings that appeared in books, in magazines, and on propaganda posters during World War I. Life in 1884, Fancher was born in Minneapolis, Minnesota. He was a student of Henry Siddons Mowbray, Robert Henry, and Kenyon Cox. He was active in San Francisco as well as in New York, where he lived most of his life. He also served in military intelligence with the U.S. Army. He is buried at Arlington National Cemetery. Notable Works Fancher illustrated two books of humorous maxims by Gillette Burgess, the Maxims of Methuselah, and the Maxims of Noah. He also created well-known propaganda and recruitment posters for the aviation section of the United States Army Signal Corps and the Committee on Public Information. Two of his oil paintings were Price Ten Cents, which had a winter sleigh theme, and Moving Lumber, which followed an exotic theme with an elephant carrying a tree trunk through a jungle. He also created postcards for automobile companies, including Pierce Arrow Motor Car Company and Packard. His illustrations for the latter featured the Packard 38 runabout in Holland, the 38 Phaeton in Paris, and the 48 touring car at the Grand Canyon. This audio was recorded on November 11, 2018. To report an error or request a change, please send an email to wikiaudio999 at gmail.com.